Okay, this is Miko. Just got back from the vets, and the vet was so impressed with him because he's just a gorgeous cat. Pure muscle. He looks like um, the Olympic athlete of the cat world. I mean, he's just great body condition. Um, she thought he might be closer to two than to one. So anywhere between 18 months to two years old was her guess. Uh, he's giving eye blinks now. Um, I can pet him now. As you can see, he's not underneath anything. <laughs> he is now in a place out more in the open. He is exploring my house now. So he's ran across my dogs. No reaction at all. In fact, he just walked right past them. Um, didn't phase him. So he must have been used to dogs. Um, if I'm petting him like this now, I can get some elevator butts sometimes. Um, he gets to purr right away. Look at those beautiful blue eyes. He's such a sweet kitty. I'm trying to see if you can hear him purr. But he'll start to purr. He starts to roll over and give me more his belly. So he's just getting a little bit more relaxed. He's still shy. Like he won't come up to me. But I can come up to him now. He's not running away. He's not hiding under a bed. Um, so he's getting there. So it's almost two weeks. I think it's like 12 days now. And you know, he's getting more comfortable. He realizes nobody's gonna kill him here. Yeah, he's getting fed and he's being treated well. Uh, this guy does eat very well. Um, I give him a can of, a three ounce can of wet food in the morning and one in the evening, and a little bit of dry food between those times to hold him over. And everything is gone. He, he loves his food. I'm giving him only instinct single protein turkey because um, he was getting green, red eyes and all kinds of gooky stuff around his eyes. <laughs> I think he, he knows he's on the camera. He's going to close his eyes and not give you, not show you to him. Um, he has been with my cats. My cats come in here, um, check out his food bowl. Um, he just ignores them. Uh, no reaction at all. So I think he, I've been told that he's had um, a bad experience in the past with other cats that they bully him. So maybe his strategy is to just chill and stay still and not move and you know hopefully the cats will go away and leave him alone, which they do. So his, um, he's kind of just neutral with, uh, with regards to cats. Definitely cannot go home to a bully cat. Dogs, he's fine with them. He's walked past my dogs and it, no, nothing phases him with regards to the dogs. So as long as there's not a dog barking at him or lunging at him, um, he should be fine. So that's Nico. He's healthy. He is ready to go home. And he needs to go home to somebody who's willing to work with him for, I would say, two weeks, a, a month. You know, just to come in, put him on your lap, pet him, hold him, and love him. And pretty soon you're going to have a cat that was going to get out of his shell and finally, um, you know, just become a normal cat. Now he's, he's still very scared. He's still very shy. Uh, but I can see lots of signals um, that he is progressing. So great cat. Ask about Miko.